Introduction My grandfather's health is not good these days. Is he having some serious problem? Yes. Don't you remember that day teacher told us in class that health is a state of being well enough to function well physically, mentally and socially. My grandfather is getting old and so he is becoming weak physically. Yes, I remember that teacher also told us that the health of all organisms depends on their environment. The environment includes the physical environment. Example, in a cyclone or a flood, health is at risk in many ways. Ankita, do you know that even in normal of disease, understand vaccination. Disease Do you know that when we are unhealthy, then we are having one or more diseases? Disease, what is that? I have read that disease means disturbed ease. Yes, scientifically, disease can be defined as a disordered or incorrectly functioning organ, part, structure or system of the body resulting from the effect of genetic or developmental error. Influenza Difference between communicable and non-communicable diseases Can you tell me the difference between communicable and non-communicable diseases? Yes, communicable can be transmitted from an infected person to a healthy person, while non-communicable diseases cannot be transmitted. Communicable diseases are by microbes called pathogens. Non-communicable diseases are caused by deficiency of nutrient or hormone or degeneration of tissue or tumor formation or hypersensitivity of body. Symptoms of Diseases Ankita, I want to tell you that disease symptoms are of two types. Organo or tissue specific manifestations and common manifestations. Principle of Treatment Okay Madhuri, I also want to tell you the principle of treatment of various diseases are Symptom Directed and pathogen directed. Principles of prevention. Similarly, there are two broad methods of prevention of disease, general ways and specific ways. Summary. Let us summarize what we have learned. Health is a state of physical, mental and social well-being. The health of an individual is dependent on his or her physical surroundings and his or her economic status. Diseases are classified as acute or chronic depending on their duration, contagious or acquired on the basis of heredity or developed during lifetime. Disease can be from infectious or non-infectious causes. Infectious agents belong to different categories of organisms and may be unicellular and microscopic or multicellular. The category to which a disease-causing organism belongs decides the type of treatment. Infectious agents are spread through air, water, physical contact or vectors. Prevention of disease is more desirable than its successful treatment. Infectious diseases can be prevented by public health hygiene measures that reduce exposure to infectious agents.